dumping duty on jute products from Bangladesh, Nepal for five years. Uh, Naveen Shetty is joining us right now to tell us more uh, on the news item and then we speak with a player in the sector. Naveen, take it away. So as you pointed out, uh, jute stocks are in focus in today's trade as anti-dumping duty has been levied on the import of jute from Bangladesh as well as Nepal. So the total demand in the country annually is anywhere close to 1.5 million tons. So what I understand from people in the industry is that almost uh, 15 to 17 percent of this demand is met by the imported goods from Bangladesh as well as Nepal. Rest is by Indian players. But the problem and the bone of contention of the Indian manufacturers is because of which they had proposed an anti-dumping duty to the finance ministry is basically that the landing price of this imported jute from Bangladesh as well as Nepal is anywhere around 60,000 per ton while the cost of manufacturing of Indian manufacturers is around 66,000 tons. So with the levy of this, uh, uh, this duty which is in the range of $6 to $350 per ton, remember this is a range and not a specific uh, anti-dumping duty, the prices will increase. It is, they are not saying that the import will shut down totally but the prices will increase which which will make it more competitive for the jute players to go ahead and participate in the manufacturing. So that is the reason we are seeing the likes of Gloucester, uh, Ludlow Jute as well as Cheviot up in trade today. Back to you. Okay, thank you.